What a cold Christmas this turned out to be, especially in the Arctic regions. One thing's for sure, Santa's got it made in the shade this year. The Jolly Old Elf's toy delivery route will take him around the world, including stops in warm spots like the Bahamas, San Tropez, and Bora Bora. Guess we'd all like to ride along with him this Christmas. Santa makes the list, but as head elf of this here workshop, it is my Christmas duty to check it twice. Naughty, naughty, nice. Why, looky here. Little Robbie gets a paddle ball. Hmm, eye hand coordination never was my strong suit. The great thing about this toy is that it feels so good when you stop. I better get back to work if and I want to be Santa's exclusive ride-along helper this year. Hmm? Now, now there, little fella. Santa's got a rule against peeking at presents before Christmas. Yup, I'm sorry, but you gotta make like you're under the mistletoe and kiss off. Huh? Ouch! I'm telling you for the last time, this here sack is not for peekers. I'm gonna send this penguin all the way to springtime. The holiday season is not the best time to take up running. Oh, Smedley! Smedley! Smedley, where are you? Uh -huh. Now, Smedley, there's no time to lay about on the job. There's work to be done. <laughs> you need to finish up the gift list while I get ready for my midnight ride. Ah, hi, Mr. C. Right away, sir. I gotta work extra diligent like now so as I can get to ride along with Santa Claus. Doggy, check. Ah, uh, ain't he cuter than a bug's ear? Ducky, check. <laughs> Kinda reminds me of Aunt Mabel's Thanksgiving dinner. Not nearly enough stuffing. Pangu Penguin? <laughs> Looks like I got me a misfit toy. This is what we elves call an occupational hazard. You are hankering to be numero uno on Santa's naughty list, aren't you? Here's one finely crafted airplane. <sighs> yes, sir. With my attention to detail, Santa's sure to pick me as this year's ride along elf helper. Uh -huh. Usually it's the tree that gets trimmed, not the elf. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. I'll ground that penguin for sure. Huh? Whoa! I say, whoa! Uh-oh. In your face, penguin. Uh, yeah, uh, my abashed apologies, sir. Smedley, what have I told you about playing with the toys? They're for the good boys and girls. Now please, get back to work. If that little penguin thinks he's got the best of this elf, 
He's barking up the wrong chimney. So, he wants to get in this bag, does he? Well, the only sure way to stop a penguin is chemistry. If and I whip me up here some super sticky glue, I'll trap him like a fly in molasses. <laughs> Tree sap. Icky goo. Puss and stuff. Chewing gum. Natural glycerin. Ooh. Smedley, I want to thank you for all your hard work this Christmas. But you look so tired. Take the rest of the night off. Ho, 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 ho. But, but I... Ho, 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 ho. sure you give that chili nothing but call for Christmas. Whoa! You hear me? Nothing but call, hard call. Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! Sports fans, and welcome to the opening of the Antarctic Games, sponsored by Mama Dulap's Old Fashioned Chocolate. The chocolate preferred by four out of five hungry penguins. Mama Dulap invites you to join us at the extreme sporting event of the century. We guarantee plenty of excitement, food, thrills, food, and most of all, food. Tickets go on sale, well, right now. Mm-mm. I just love being the official head of security for these here Antarctic Games. I'm sworn to keep all riffraff off of these premises. Hmm. What have we here? It looks like I've corralled me a penguin of the gate-crashing persuasion. Well, I'm escorting you from the premises. Guard rule number one. Always be leery of the tuxedo wearers. Whoa! Yeah. Hmm. This here ice is mighty cold on the lower lumbar. Wee, 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 wee. You pull over now so as I can under arrest you. It looks like we have a couple of late entries in the ice skating competition, ladies and gentlemen. What style that big fella has. What a left hook that little fella has. <laughs> now I got you, you little... Ow! That smart. <laughs> that smart Alec bird is definitely skating on your proverbial thin ice. <laughs> but there ain't a penguin alive who can outsmart a minimum wage security officer. Except maybe this one. What an amazing performance! We have a new gold medal winner! And now, in the Mama Dulap's Antarctic Games tradition, the winner of every event gets a meal at the Table of Champions. <laughs> No gate crasher is gonna be outsmarting me. Hmm, needs a tad more salt. Hold on one ice picking minute. 
This is the law of talking. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but water will not hurt me. <gasps> Unless it has been modified to solid form. Hold it where you are. They ain't a gate crasher alive who can get away from me. <laughs> what style? What a landing. That'll probably cause what we in the guard business call a boo-boo. You know what? My boo-boo smarts. What an amazing run. This surprise contestant has won his second event of the game. And he's wasting no time heading to the table of champions to celebrate. All right, gate crasher, hand over that drumstick. Ouch! Chili Willie has come out of nowhere to take the lead in the 100-mile ice gliding race. All right, you pull over. Huh? <laughs> that there is the oldest trick in the book. Yep, sometimes it takes a while, but I always prove I'm twice as smart as everyone says I think I am. You know, you don't see these great white polar sharks very often. We're 50 miles into the race, and Chili's still in first place. We're less than 100 yards from the finish line, and it's still anyone's race. When I catch this law-breaking icebreaker, he's going to chill in the cooler for a long while. This is what we in the business call a hot pursuit. They don't get any hotter than this. Amazing! Chili has won three gold medals in one day. And now he's enjoying his third meal at the Table of Champions. I did my job. I may be tired, but it's a good kind of tired. The Antarctic Games may be over, but you can enjoy Mama Dulap's old-fashioned chocolate all year long. Remember, it's a gold medal treat. <laughs> As head headhunter of this here operation, I live by the headhunter's motto. If you want them, we'll get them. Required immediately. One penguin for placement in beautiful tropical Montezuma Zoo. Beg money to find her. Mm-hmm. Bingo. It's a penguin, all right. Mush! Sled! Start the sled! I got him! Mush! I always get my man. What are you stopping for, pup? Mighty large pair of underwear for such a little feller. Ah! This'll stick him. 
<laughs> no, no, there are laws against this kind of thing, you know. Isn't that thoughtful? Mmm, lapso apso oolong, my favorite. A little cream and lots of sugar. Mmm. I'm out of here. Look, kid, cut me some slack, will you? This is the offer of a lifetime. All I want is to take you to this tropical paradise. It's all expenses paid and tax deductible, plus all the fish you can eat. All right, all right, you can drive. Now, will you go with me? Phew! What a workout! Woohoo! The headhunters are finally here! We got the tank all ready! It's set to sub 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 zero temperature and comes with its own iceberg for the penguin. So, which one is the penguin? <laughs> but, 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 no, it's, it's, it's 